Well, I'm worried about the phosphorus loading. Uh, it's causing the harmful algal blooms in the western basin of Lake Erie. That is probably my primary concern, uh, but I'm also concerned about fracking, um, the contamination of groundwater with chemicals that we don't know what they are um, because it's proprietary, so we don't know what's going into the ground. We know that they're putting a lot in, withdrawing a lot of water, you know, to, to in the hydraulic fracking process. Uh, I'm concerned about withdrawals, Nestle withdrawal in particular, they're withdrawing tons of water for very little. Actually, they're not paying anything. Um, I know it costs them to take the water out, but they're not paying anything for the water. So uh, that's a concern. But in Southeast Michigan, in the Detroit area where I work, it's most, mostly uh, stormwater contamination, phosphorus loading, both from urban and agricultural. What could International Joint Commission do about this? Primarily, right now, I do believe the Agriculture and Farm Bureau says, I do believe that mandatory requirements um, for agriculture are important. I know that they're working hard, that there are farmers that are doing these voluntary measures, um, and I appreciate that. You know, I know that some are really, you know, they're, they're working really hard because they don't want there to be mandatory requirements, but there are mandatory requirements for urban, for the wastewater treatment plants, and, I, and it's worked. You know, we have you know, less phosphorus loading. Some say at this point, uh, it looks like maybe 20% of that are coming, you know, phosphorus is coming from the urban environment. So I think we need some mandatory restrictions because Lake Erie is not getting better, it's getting worse. Last question for you, the cuts proposed by the Trump administration, what would that do for the issues you're concerned about, like fracking, like testing the wastewater, like algal blooms? I think that the, the greatest harm is because is really stopping the progress that's already been made. We have um, some of the areas of concern have been addressed. They're, they're taking them off the list, they're delisted, um, and there are many more areas of concern that need to be addressed. I am extremely concerned about uh, the Asian carp and uh, them not you know, releasing the study, the Brandon Road study. Mm -hmm. um, so that's critical, and that's that has been ceased under the Trump administration. Um, and the funding for the Great Lakes. And again, there's a lot of progress, tons of progress, but we are not finished. There's so much more work yet to be done, and that is a great